Hey guys. Oh. Come join us. Hey everybody, come down. Wow, there are a lot of you guys. They're going to have so much fun teaching you over in Children's Church. Did you know that? They're going to have fun. I brought something and I would imagine that every one of you know what to do with. What do you do with these? Color. What are you supposed to do? Color. What are you supposed to do? Color. color. Okay, are there rules to coloring? What is the... If you were to teach somebody to color, what would you teach them? What would you say to them? If they say, I see you do such a good job, what would you say? Color inside the lines. What do the rest of you think? Is that important? Yes. Yeah. It's important. Is that a rule that you're supposed to color in the lines? Yeah. Because sometimes we take crayons and we'll take it and we just say, okay, I know that I want to do this, but I want to do it real quickly. Right? And then we take and we color kind of like this. Okay? Uh. Is that good? No. No, sometimes we do it though, because especially if we're kind of in a bad mood and we say, I don't really want to color, I just, so I'll just fill up the page with, with a color and that won't be good. But, like you said, we, can, we need to color inside the lines, right? That's the best way we yeah. learn to, and sometimes, is that hard? Do you find it hard to color inside the lines? Yeah. It is very hard sometimes. But you know, we practice and practice and practice. And sometimes I see adults still practicing how to color on paper, and so that's, that's a good thing. But now let me ask you, I have a lot of different colors here. If I were to color that, um, that boat, what color would you color it? Brown. What would you color it? Brown. Brown? Would everybody color it brown? Yeah. 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 Why? Because it's wood. It's wood? Wood is oh. brown. Okay, so you'd want to keep it brown. What about the sail on the boat? What color would you make white. it? White. 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 Can a white can a sail ever be anything other than white? Black. It could be black. But could it be anything other than white? Yes. I suppose it could be. And if you colored it some other color, it'd be okay. What about this? What about white. here's a picture of Peter and of Jesus? What about their clothes? What color would you color it? Um I'd color it like maroon. Maroon, because you like maroon. What about you? Nah, just anything. What about you? I don't color it brown. What? Brown. Brown. You'd color that brown. What about the rest of you? Do you have a favorite color you'd color it? I like orange and blue. Orange and blue. Yeah, that would be nice. Because you say, well, right. some things it doesn't matter, and some things it does. But the rule is you keep it inside the lines. But most things you can just color any color that you want to. Right? Well, you know, God has a lot of things for us and he tells us what to do and sometimes we know what we're supposed to do and we don't give much attention to it. It's like coloring outside the lines. You know, we just do it the way that we want to do it at the time and, and we're not too worried about it, right? But other times we say, okay, what has God told me to do? And I need to do it the way he wants me to do it. And so even though he gives us a lot of freedom to do things, he still wants us to follow him and to do the things the way he wants us to do it. So that's kind of like coloring inside the lines, okay? Because we want our lives to be like he intended it to be. You agree? Everybody agree with me? Yes. All right, that's good. Well, let's bow our heads to pray. And after we pray, you can go to Children's Church. So everybody bow your head, close your eyes, and let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for the children. Thank you for their teachers this morning, and I pray you'll bless each and every one of them. And Father, that uh, they would learn today more about you and more about the things you want them to do. Help them today to have a good time. But also, dear God, more important than that, that, uh, that they learn and that they're obedient. Bless them now, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. All right.